Michael, JD, promoted to the Northern Premier League, Premier Division. Unbelievable stuff. Yeah, um, we didn't expect that today, you know. Uh, but that's just, I think that's just us over the years, you know. Every time people think we're down, down and out and we, we come back and we keep coming back. We've had a little bit of luck today, but we haven't had that in previous games, you know. We, we, we can speak about that, but today we we just kept going and kept going. We weren't ourselves in the first half for the, for the two goals, and we come in at half time, and there was a lot said, you know. And the players reacted. They reacted to everything that went against them today, and I don't mean that referee wise. I mean <coughs> goals for the players. They dug in. I'm so proud of them. I've told them there that so proud of, to for what they've achieved after. They could have felt sorry for themselves after that, that Winterton game when we, we, we were at rock bottom, you know, and they reacted really well to that and to go and win the playoffs in a manner that they did as well uh, makes it even more unbelievable. Yeah, just the emotion packed into that, the fact that we've lost two playoff finals before this, we were 3-1 down, we've got it back to 2-1, you think oh, you're motivated and then they make it 3-1 and think maybe that's done. And just to, to keep going and get through this game, it just... As I, say, as I said before, unbelievable. It's just incredible, really. I mean, that's it's it's a surreal feeling at the moment. It feels like no matter what you, where you are in the ground or what you've done, probably there, that that's incredible what just happened there. Like we probably were behind the vast majority of the whole game, and to come out and as winners is unbelievable. And it's just a testament to the to the lads, the club, and everything about us, really, and what we do. But to do it in that manner that we've done today was absolutely just incredible. Yeah, and how, how does it feel to actually do it for you know your hometown team? Because it's emotional, isn't it, to, to sort of see how big this football club has become over the last, well, 10 years while you've been here, uh, from the back pitches of over near St. Bede's there. Just... The school we both used to attend, by the way, <laughs> yeah. which is another nice little link. Yeah, we, um, I think we spoke... I think eight years ago we were we were just we were just getting promoted out of the Wayside League, and obviously we had two years where that was split with with COVID, and that stumped us a little bit. But we've come so far in such a short space of time, and I'm I'm pretty sure that the club will just continue to grow. I mean, to play to to now be playing that step three is just an unbelievable achievement from everyone involved, whether that's players, management, committee. Chairman, you know, people work in the bar, the fans, you know, everybody, everybody pulls in the right direction in this club, and I think at, over the season we 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 deserve to go up, you know, we look back at the games what we've let ourselves down in a bit, but we bounce back from that, and that jo just shows the mentality of the players, the mentality of of us um, that we never give in, and, and it and it would have been easy to do, I think, with with us losing the league, um, but also fair play to, the, to heaven for what they did, I've said that before, because um, they've had an unbelievable run and, and fair play to them for what they did, they've got a, 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 as well a, a great management team and, and great players as well, so it's testament to them for what they've achieved, but we've had to build our players back up, the players have got themselves back in the right mindset and doing what they've done today and we just can't ask anything more and they'll, they'll, they'll enjoy themselves tonight I'm pretty sure they'll enjoy themselves in the beat the next week as well uh, and they deserve it uh, because it's been tough it's been tough hard long season and they've got they've got what we asked them to do at the start of the season yeah, and what does it mean to celebrate that after you know we were denied during Covid to celebrate what would be surely would have been a Northern League title I said um it's been we, we we talk obviously we talk all the time, um, and it, it's it's nice to actually win the final because I don't think we have actually won one since the the Wayside League. Um, we've got the finals at I mean, Wembley was a, was a great achievement, but we didn't win. And when you when you're in football, you want to win things, um, and and we we've won that. We've lost the two previous playoff finals, and I, I said last week. When we got back to the clubhouse after the the Belper game and the fans were there, they were still there and they applauded us in and 
I just said uh, it, it's it's unbelievable. The fans are, are, are great, you know, and they'll be there behind us no matter what. But I wanted them to celebrate something. I didn't want them to for us to be second. You know, we were second in the league, but today we're winners, and and that's what that's what we want to be. And and I'm so pleased for everyone that's involved in the club. And I'm just so pleased that we we've got through all this season. And finally, looking forward to testing ourselves at step three. What are your thoughts on that? Well, we've got to get over the day first. It's like, who's going to be in the league? Where are we going? What are we doing? It's like, it, there's so much emotion going into this. And obviously, the, the game's going to go right into the weekend. And we'll probably have a look at things tomorrow, have a look at things on Monday, see what else has been happening. And um, see where we're going next year. Absolutely ridiculous, really. We'll enjoy the next couple of days first, yeah, and then we'll we'll have a look at that. Yeah. I just want to say congrats, guys, because I felt you've been doubted a lot this season, and you've, you've pulled through it today. Just yeah, fantastic achievement from both of you. Thanks, James. Thanks, James. Thanks. I appreciate it. Cheers.